Hi everyone, welcome to my channel, Swannamans Biology. So here we are going to answer some of the important PYQs from the Lesson Kingdom Monera. So it is a continuation of our before video from the chapter Biological Classification. So let us start. See the first question. Some hyperthermophilic organisms that grow in high acidic habitats belong to the two groups. A. Eubacteria and Archaebacteria. B. Cyanobacteria and diatoms. C. Protists and mosses. D. Liver wasps and yeast. So, we know that both Eubacteria and Archaebacteria belong to the kingdom Monera. Eubacteria are... Um, some of the eubacteria are hyperdermophilic in nature and we know that archaebacteria are of three types that is hyperdermoacidophiles, uh, uh, dermophilic bacteria as well as hyalophilic bacteria which live in very much harsh habitats because of the cell wall. And uh, so even the eubacteria, some of the eubacteria means uh, also live in the high Temperature, uh, temperature regions, so they are hyperdermophilic in nature. So, the correct option is to let us see whether our answer is correct or wrong. Let us check. Yeah, it is correct. Here, the explanation is also given. We know that the molarans include two types of the organisms that is eubacteria as well as archaebacteria. So, eubacteria means we know they are atrobacteria and we know this eubacteria are again two types that is bacteria as well as cyanobacteria. Again, some of the bacteria will live in the high temperature regions. They are called as hypothermophilic organisms. Archaebacteria again are of three types. Just now we have discussed they are dermoacidophiles, dermophilic bacteria as well as halophiles. So, our option is correct. So, now let us proceed to the next question. Membrane bound organelles are absent in A. Saccharomyces, B. Streptococcus, C. Chlamydomonas, D. Plasmodium. So, children, you have to remember membrane bound organelles will be absent in prokaryotes, means mainly bacteria. So, among these, so streptococcus is the correct answer why it is because it is bacteria so we are answering streptococcus let us see whether our option is correct yeah it is correct so membrane bound organelles are absent uh, in streptococcus why because it is uh, present in the kingdom monera so normally what prokaryotes lack the membrane bound organelles what are the membrane bound organelles they are mitochondria endoplasmic reticulum golgi apparatus so, all these are membrane bound organelles which will not be present in the prokaryotic organisms. Whereas, Chlamydomonas, Plasmodium, all these are eukaryotes which contain the membrane bound organelles. Even Saccharomyces is yeast which contains the membrane bound organelles. So, let us proceed to the next question. Select the correct combination of the statements 1 to 4 regarding the characteristics of the certain organisms. 1. Methadogens are archaebacteria which produces methane in marshy areas. 2. Nostoc is filamentous blue-green algae which fixes atmospheric nitrogen. 3. Chemosynthetic autotrophic bacteria synthesize cellulose from glucose. 4. Mycoplasma lack a cell wall and survive without oxygen. So, we have to select which options are correct. We know methadogens are archaebacteria and which produce methane in the marshy areas. So, the first option is correct. See the second option. Nostoc is a filamentous blue-green algae which fixes atmospheric nitrogen. So, it is also correct. Chemosynthetic autotrophic bacteria synthesize cellulose from glucose. So, it is strong. Mycoplasma lack a cell wall and survive without oxygen. So, this is also correct. So, 1, 2 and 4 are correct. So, we, we can answer this and let us see whether our option is correct or wrong. So, 1, 2 and 4. 1, 2 and 4. Yeah, it is correct. So, here the explanation also there. So, chemosynthetic bacteria, they oxidize various inorganic substances. What are they? Nitrates, nitrites and ammonia. And they are used for the ATP production. But not they synthesize the cellulose from the glucose. Okay. So, only the third option is wrong. Let us see the next question. 
So, which one of the following also act as a catalyst in the bacterial cell? 5 S R RNA, S N R N A, H N R N A, 23 S R N A. So the correct option is 23 S R N A because uh, this act as a catalyst um, in the <clears throat> during the replication. So let us see. So it is correct. So see the explanation. 23 S R N A is a component of the ribosome of 50 years okay so the ribosomal peptide transfer is um, this activity resides in the rrna and act as a catalytic rna so this 23 srna act as um, the catalytic rna whereas this is in the case of the prokaryotic cell whereas in the case of the eukaryotes so there will be 80 years so the components will be 60 years as well as 40 years so in the 60 years there will be 20 years uh, 28 s component of rrna which uh, takes the activity of this catalytic activity okay so the correct option is 23 s rrna so now let us proceed to the next question which one of the following organisms is not a eukaryotic cell see the options Paramecium chordatum, B. Escherichia coli, C. Euglena viridis, D. Amoeba proteus. So we have to see which organism is not eukaryote. Okay. So Paramecium chordatum, Euglena viridis, Amoeba proteus, all are eukaryotes. They belong to the protozoa. But Escherichia coli is a bacteria which is a prokaryote. Yes. So we have to answer that. Yeah. So these are all protozoans which belong to the eukaryotes. Whereas Escherichia coli is a prokaryote which mm, means which doesn't contain the true nucleus. Now let us see the next question. In new bacteria, a cellular component that resembles the eukaryotic cell is? So we have to see the options now. Plasma membrane, nucleus, ribosomes and cell wall. So actually ribosomes there will be a difference. Why? Because in prokaryotes it will be 70 years and eukaryotes it is 80 years. Nucleus is also different. So what we have named as prokaryotes and eukaryotes. Cell wall is also, actually cell wall is absent in the animal cell. So in the eubacteria, which is similar to that of the eukaryotic cell is plasma membrane. Yeah. Plasma membrane of eubacteria resembles plasma membrane of eukaryotic cell. But nucleus, ribosomes and cell walls are little different in the eukaryotic cell in their structure and organization from that of the eubacterial cell. Eubacterial cell. So let us see the next question. Which one of the following is incorrectly matched? So see the question. Root pressure and gutation, coccinia and smut, root and exact protoxylum, the cassia and imbricate instivation. So, B is the correct option because smut is caused by uh, some of the um, some of the organisms belong uh, belong to the species coccinia. So, rest is a group of uh, means resistant group of parasitic fungi of the phylum basidiomyta okay many of these species attack the leaf and stems of several crops mainly the pathogens of the rest are paxenia uromyces so these are all fungi which causes smut so our answer is correct now let us see the next question maximum nutritional diversity is found in which group fungi animalia Monera and plantae. So actually, uh, if we see Monera, Monera includes uh, Archaebacteria and Eubacteria. In Archaebacteria, also we have seen three types of the uh, three types of the organisms that is uh, Dermoacidophiles, Methanogens, as well as Halophiles, and even the Eubacteria. We uh, they are uh, Cyanobacteria as well as bacteria so most of the nutritional diversity is present in monera when compared to the other organisms let us check the answer yeah see here the explanation is also given though bacterial structure is very simple they are very complex so compared to many other organisms bacteria show a wide variety of metabolic diversity okay so the same explanation is given 
Let us proceed to the next question. Nuclear membrane is absent in A. Penicillium, B. Agaricus, C. Volvox, and D. Nostoc. We have to see in which organism the nuclear membrane is absent. So actually, Penicillium, Agaricus, and Volvox, all these are fungi which contain a nuclear membrane, and Nostoc is a cyanobacteria, so which belongs to the kingdom Monera. So it is a prokaryote yeah it is a prokaryote which lacks the nuclear membrane so our option is correct now let let us see the next question cyanobacteria are also referred to as so this is very easy question we know cyanobacteria are also called as blue green algae yeah so cyanobacteria are also uh, known as blue green algae why because they perform the oxygenic photosynthesis okay they are mostly autotrophs and are found in um, all the types of the environment like fresh water sea water moist rocks etc 